Greetings everyone, this is Spin Dash, and welcome back to another episode of my Metro 2033 Redux playthrough on the Survival Ranger Hardcore difficulty. I will aim for all notes and gain all moral points to aim for the good ending. In today's episode, we'll be playing the Lost Tunnels level. So without further delay, let's set off for Dry Station with Bourbon. Ну теперь гляди в оба, пацанчик. Это тебе не на дрезине кататься. В этом туннеле куча серьезных мужиков полегла. Но если будем друг друга прикрывать, все путем будет. Что за? А, это просто кикимора. Они на отряды не нападают никогда. Но вот если ты один идешь, остерегайся. Лерка, а? They sound like a bunch of annoying creatures. From that quartz we can grab the shotgun shells, as well as the SMG ammo, or the assault rifle ammo I should say. Странный звук. От земли что ли идет? Или это ветер? Слышишь, слыхал истории про поющие трубы? Говорят, если приложить ухо к трубам и прислушиваться, можно чисто услышать голоса мертвецов. Херня, правда? What a BS, he says. How about we go over the pipes and take a listen and find out for ourselves, shall we? Well then, doesn't look like it. There's uh, some voices coming out of those pipes. But before we catch up with Bourbon, who ran all the way over there to that train, let's head to the left here and have our first encounter with the Lurkers. They are a very annoying critter that we just saw earlier, so... Be ready for them. Ah, <sighs> dang it. Alright, that's the first one. And the second one. So yeah, those are lurkers. They're very quick, very nimble, and very annoying, especially in droves. But our reward for taking care of these lurkers is that we get the, the T-Car, which is our a silent pneumatic weapon. Which means that it's going to be great for stealth, which we're definitely going to need in the next encounter. Although our ammo supply is pretty limited at the moment, but we'll keep it. Grab the shotgun shells and the pipe bomb from this corpse. And let's follow Borbin once more. Who is patiently waiting for us on the other side of the tracks, so let's catch up. Grab that revolver ammo if you need it. Вот дерьмо. Это ж челноки из каравана. Все жмуры. Узнаю почерк Третьяковских, а Ганза все грозится с ними покончить. Так, теперь будет нас. А это шухер у них такой. Ну, типа система тревоги. Древняя как мир и простая как сатиновые трусы. Ну, работа. Смотри не за день банки. Well, before we do that, let's grab some stuff from this corpse, and then we'll grab the key from this guy. We'll need this in our next room, with the bandits. So let's follow Bourbon again, and avoid the cans. Just hug the wall. Reach over the MGR, grab the throwing knife and the ammunition on the right shelf. А это у нас растяжечка. Ха-ха, железная маза избавится от слепых и от безбашен. Знаешь, что делать? Да они тут баррикад настроили, ну чистая революция. Тюрьму. Надо поближе подойти. Давай, обезвредь постовых. I'll see what I can do. This is our first human encounter with the bandits, so we're gonna try and be stealthy as possible. You can knock or kill him out. Doesn't matter. Depends on. Just a. 
take this guy out. Grab his stuff. Hug this wall on the right. As long as we stay in the shadows, they will not notice us. And these guys over at the campfire are going to have a big ol' conversation. And once they're done, they're going to get up and move their way. But in the meantime, we're going to take out this guy over here and the guy over there. Since this guy is just very oblivious, I'm going to go ahead and throw the throwing knife at him. And you can pick it up too. Now for this guy. Might as well go to the safe, open it up, and get the munitions. Alright, let's wait for these guys to exhaust all their dialogue. <laughs> All right, they're getting up. All right, this guy's going to the back. He'll be our first target. Knock him out. This guy in the campfire is next. Take him out. I'll take this guy. I'll just use the throwing knife on this guy. I just don't like taking him out from the front. There's a, and this guy's next. We'll take the guy with the lantern last. Oh, I hit the can. Crap. <sighs> Alright. That's the first encounter. Now we can go to the next room. That was close. Take this guy out. That guy did not notice him. I'll knock you out. There's one last guy in the back. Up. Oh, he's alerted. You're getting blown to shreds. Okay. That's that room. So you can do it stealthily. Again, let me grab some of the loot back there. I was so busy trying to get all that stealth done. Okay. Oh, goodies over there. Lots of them. So you can just go back to the corpses that you've taken out or killed, whatever. And you can grab your loot. And we could use that, because we're going to need it later on. And that's the first bed in encounter. There are many ways you can approach it. Survival mode, you don't want to go stealthily. If you're going on Spartan playthrough, that's a different story. You can go crazy, but we're going to continue our mission here and follow Bourbon. Мост чисто стрёмное место, пацанчик. Вот тепла. Я тебя крою, а ты гляди за мной. Будем идти вместе, справимся. И не выделывайся там. Мне ещё жить охота. Our first note in the Lost Tunnels will be right over here. This could be quite easy to miss if you're going for the rush, but just slow down. It'll be right here around this area, so go ahead and grab it. Yeah, the relationship between Artyom and Bourbon seems... We just met, and he seems like a shady figure, but he seems alright so far. I think so. Okay, so let's hop over here. <laughs> what the? <gasps> okay. Alright, so I don't know why that happened. It was... Literally, I jumped over there, but the game's like, we're not gonna let you jump. 
but... That, that's alright. Sometime... Oh, what's this? Oddly enough, I've never seen that. That is the first time it's ever happened to me there in this game. That never happens. Hopefully that doesn't happen again. Also, grab the shotgun ammunition and the filter. Alright, is the game gonna allow me to jump through here? We'll see. Okay, that time we did it. Okay. Alright. Alright, we got an encounter. You can let Bourbon help you out with most of this. Here comes the first one. Alright. There's that first one taken care of. There's gonna be more coming soon. Gonna be more coming soon. I don't feel comfortable. Let me get a med kit popped. All right, Bourbon's good at tending those in the salises. We don't have to do too much work. This thing we charged. Yeah, Hansa trolley will be passing through here, and Bourbon will notice that. They're looking for bandits, but as long as we stay crouched down, we should be okay. We'll gain a moral point too if we avoid their spotlight. And we'll lose one if we get caught. Alright, let's move on then. Alright, nothing here, so... Here comes another Nassalus encounter. Why the Hansa trolley does not spot that, we don't know. I got a lot more. There's a lot of space here, so you can just let Bourbon do all the heavy work. They will not come in from behind. Yeah. There should be more coming soon. Long revolver. Or a revolver for long barrel, but we're not going to be needing that. Let's get in the train here. Uh oh. Heck yeah, it was. Probably the worst train ride I've ever experienced. Let's continue on. You can swap out this duplicate for a much better one. It has a stock and a better grip, which is much... It handles better. It's a direct upgrade from the one we got from our friend. We can grab the flame raisers and some shells, if I can speak. Let's get on the other side real quick. There's some... If I remember correctly, there's some loot over there. Yes, some more shotgun shells. We could always use them. So we're finding a lot of Nasalises lately, so... Oh boy. 
More Nasalises, what do you know? Wanna give me a hand, Bourbon? Spoiler alert, you will. Here comes the next one. Two of them. That one went straight for me instead of bourbon. Then again, I'm the one who takes damage, not him. Let's go through this tunnel here. Что это за хрень со мной была? Артем, ты слышал это? Фух. Ну и песни. Слаще Владимирского Централа. Но страшно. That was pretty terrifying after that seeing that hallucination. It appears the dark one saved us from being pulled in and losing our way. Our second key is going to be all the way over there, so we have to do some platforming. So let's do a jump here, jump here. Oh, yeah, we're not falling down again. Hopefully, so let's grab the key, sprint over here. Yeah, let's continue on. This corpse will have some, I give us some goodies here. And we're gonna jump down here. Don't worry, we'll meet him bur with bur bourbon in a second. Gotta throw a knife. Wait a minute. Oh, alright, there's only two. I was thinking there was three notes in Lost Tunnel. It's like, didn't want to restart a playthrough for this. Okay. Ну вот это все мир. Ты главная рта не раскрывай, папочка все сделает. Right. But before we can catch up Punk Bourbon. That does not sound good. Let's go up here. Because remember that second key we got? It's gonna be useful here. There's a couple of stuff we can get, such as these well. Raise a revolver, but I won't be needing that again. 
So if we go all the way over here, our safe. Well. I just. I'm just dumb. I'm just dumb. What I should have done is just get this valve. Why I didn't do that, I don't know. But anyway, aside from my st oh, it seems like the biggest threat in this playthrough so far is my own stupidity. But anyway, let's just continue on. And our second note and final note of this will be right here. So let's go ahead and grab it. Alright. Yeah, these are some cursed tunnels, especially after that whole hallucination we faced. And if it weren't for that dark one, we wouldn't have been saved. So let's catch up with Uncle Berman, Bourbon and get into the market. Люди, братва, откройте, прошу, не дайте помереть страшной смертью. Вы что, оглохли? Нас тут сожрут сейчас! Ублюдки, кого вы за собой притащили? Упырей! Семен, заводи дрессик, спасем этих полутру. Артем, держись, нам сегодня карта прет! All right, this is gonna be on the sauce encounter again. Oh, that guy went straight through bourbon. The main strategy is to keep them at bay. Run around the circles if you have to, just to avoid the Nassauluses and let Bourbon try and take care of them. That one just fell out dead. Ну-ка, покажитесь. Слушайся его. Эти ребята вообще юмора не понимают. All right. Какая встреча! Может быть, это обман зрения? Нет же, это Бурбон! Собственной персоны! А я уж и не надеялся, что свидимся. Семён, смотри, как кто к нам пришёл. Вот хрень! Мы вляпались, пацанчик. Э, Михалыч, какая встреча! А я как раз к тебе лыжи мылил. Слышали, мужики? Накрывайте на стол серебро. К нам Бурбон в гости пожаловал. Бурбон, ты только не нервничай и никуда не уходи. Мы сейчас закончим с этой мелюзгой, а потом уж займемся крупной рыбкой. Помнишь, где меня ждать? Да помню, помню. Уверен? А то могу и напомнить, если что. Уверен. All right then. Well, it was a very, it was a very hellish journey, but we finally got to market. Well, there it was. Lost Tunnels. 
it's a pretty ne decent start for the Metro, aside from, I will really start with Exhibition, Chase, Riga, that's mainly just introductory, and of course you got Prologue and Hunter, that's all mainly introduction. But here we really get into the beef of it, with the first encounter for lurkers, the first human encounter, the, the traps with the cans, and of course we had a bunch of Nassauces to fight. Of course I had those two deaths, I know I died twice, but most of it was because of something really dumb on the first one, where the, for whatever reason I just got blocked at the jump, and the second death being my stupidity. So. So far I haven't died at all by any of the enemy enemies, so most of the deaths I've had so far were my, was my own stupidity, me not being dummy. But aside from that, it was a pretty decent playthrough I would say. I'll try not to let stuff like that happen next time. I had to take several attempts at this, especially towards the bandit part, but I'll improve as soon as it gets on. It's like, this is the Ranger Hardcore difficulty, it's never was going to be easy, so. But, as for the Nassalis' encounter, they weren't that difficult. All you just had to do was keep them at bay, just get close and personal with them with a shotgun, and he heck, let Bourbon do all the work if you have to. There's no shame in doing that, because he, he ain't going down. So yeah, that's basically the Lost Tunnels. Next episode, we're going to explore the Marco Bourbon. Seems like he has a lot of money to owe to the Hansa Sentries, as shown in the description here. And he's very anxious to leave. But... So, let's go to the market first. Так, братан, что пытаешься протащить на сей раз? И что с тобой за пацан? Слышишь, начальник, а может все так утрясем? Конечно, пойдем поболтаем. А вы присматривайте за этим. Не двигайся. Yes, sir. Alright, well our first note is clearly right in front of us, so grab that. Yeah, we never would have gotten here by bourbon. Judging from this note, it seems like Bourbon is kind of a shady businessman. Has a lot of debt to own to the Hansa. Yeah, мы вляпались по самые помидоры. На этих перцах с дрезины у меня ЛВ точно нет. Если они нам отработать дадут, ну там типа дерьмо разгребать. Будем считать, что повезло. Ну, на Ганзу нам пути нет, но зато, слышишь, держи патроны, пойди купи пару фильтров противогазу. Есть одна мыслишка, а я пойду перетру кое с кем. Встретимся в баре, или я сам тебя позже отыщу. Ну, давай, минут пять у тебя в общем есть. There goes Bourbon. Grab the key from here, pretty easy to spot, then backtrack back to the hallway here and into the train. So we can get the safe. It's a pretty tough, you know, it's not obvious spot, but once you find it, it's pretty easy. And grab the MGR rounds. Alright, so let's continue on. So we're gonna go through the marketplace. A lot of business here. Why else isn't it called the market? But first, 
Let's get a drink, especially after that whole trip back in the lost tunnels. Oh man. Guess that vodka really does kick their butt, as they said. So. Oh dang. It really does kick our butts. That was just one shot of it. Yeah, see, another trial guitar, although you don't get a moral point for playing with that. But we will get a moral point. Well, first off, we need to listen to this. Let this old guy tell the story to the kid. Это о трех охотниках, которые отправились на станцию Полежаевскую. До или после того, как она сгинула? После, конечно. Отличная ну, одежда. И что случилось? Наследие великого Чергизона. Бери, не пожалеешь. Никто не нападал. Это хозяин туннелей приказал жителям станции друг друга перерезать. Да мне вообще ничего Ой, не ты, надо. Ты круто как! Ну все, теперь иди за бутербродом. Зачем это? Я и так уже все знаю. Давай, коди за мной на своей дрезине. All right, since the story, the older guy's done with the story, let's give him a bullet to get our next moral point. All right, so let's go into the tradesmith here. I say tradesmith, but it's this, the district. Oh yeah, second to last note would be right in front of this worker, so let's go ahead and grab that. Filters, filters, filters. Seems like Star is never talking about anything else. Well, of course you are. We're talking about radiation here. Alright. So the first thing I'm gonna do is... Let's see. We can get the Shambler here. Which I'm definitely gonna need for this next stage Dead City, so... What I'll do is I'll sell off the duplicate. Get the Shambler. Stock Shambler. Nothing else. Let me check the selection here. Yeah, just, that's it. It's a direct upgrade to the, to the duplet, in fact, of its magazine size and sheer stop power. Plus, it's very customized. So there's a shooting range here, but why do you want to do this if the ammo is so low? Eh. Beats me, but if you want to do it, just reload the checkpoints over and over again. I'm not gonna purchase any ammo because we can supply ourselves just fine. So, since we're done here, let's go back and meet up with Bourbon. There he is. Ну значит так, я тут добазарился с одним перцем. Ну конечно ж матяры нереальные, но тут уж ничего не сделать. Зашибись, все выдвигаемся. Возьми мой запасной фильтр от противогаза. Мы наверх идем. Бурбон? Будто сам не знаешь. Ну давай пульки проходи. Я уже Михи забашлял. Но мне то ты ничего не платил. Ну если ты конечно не хочешь, чтобы я тебя пропустил, платить не обязательно. Вот дерьмо. Приятно с вами иметь дело. Да ладно. Шутка. Все на изготовку. Ворота открываются. Вы уверены, товарищ командир? Все по местам. Прикройте меня. Черт. 
Ненавижу это. All right, time to head out. Up to the surface. Looks like we'll be, we will be going up there after all. Yeah, let's get out of here. I ain't too happy with bourbon. Как описать чувство, когда после 20 лет в тоннелях видишь небо, когда видишь город, в котором когда-то родился, и в котором теперь властвует чудовище. Вот он, мертвый город, сказал мне Бурбон. Добро пожаловать домой. Okay, and that's the marketplace. So yeah, I pretty much go over, went over what I want to say in the previous loading screens, but yeah. So in our next episode, we'll be approaching the surface in Dead City, one of my favorite stages in Metro 2033. I'm looking forward to this next video. It's, it's well, it's one of my favorite stages. So anyways, I'll see y'all in the next video. See ya.